Hi, my name is Lori and I'm the owner and photographer of Lori Barberly Photography. I'm a wedding photographer based in Orlando, Florida. So I got started in photography when I was a kid. I got a camera for Christmas and back in those days cameras used film and by the time Christmas Day was over I had gone through all the film that had come with the camera and then I fell in love with the anticipation of waiting to get you know prints back from the photo lab and then I was lucky enough to go to a high school that offered photography classes. I had a really great photography teacher who was a mentor to me and he recommended a college that offered degrees in photography so I went to college and got my bachelor's degree in photography. After college I started working at magazines. I worked at some women's lifestyle magazines and then I worked for a travel magazine for 10 years traveling around the world photographing different places but the whole time I wanted to capture something a little bit deeper a little bit more intimate and personal than travel photography so I started shooting portraits on the side and that developed into weddings and that's kind of when I fell in love with photographing people's love stories. So when my couples book an engagement session, we brainstorm about locations that are meaningful to them as a couple. I can recommend a ton of pretty places in Central Florida, but I prefer to photograph at locations that mean something to the couple. I think that makes the session much more personal to them. So we pick a location, we decide on the best time of day for the best light, and that works with their scheduling. We talk about wardrobe, and if they want, I can refer them to a hair and makeup artist. And on the day of the session, we really just like to have a lot of fun, you know. I will put the couple in good light, in a pretty situation, and have them interact with each other and capture those really kind of genuine interactions between the two of them. I'll have them whisper things in each other's ear. Maybe it's something sweet, maybe it's something a little spicy, um, you know, to get their partner to laugh and things like that. And just kind of have those, you know, really fun, genuine moments of, of engagement between the two of them. After the session, my clients get an online gallery of their edited high-res images, and they can use those to make prints, or we can make a guest book that can be used at their wedding, or any number of creative ideas that they can use their images for. In terms of weddings, I will help my couples to determine what the best time to have their wedding ceremony is. A lot of times couples and even venues don't think about what time the sun is setting and how that will impact their wedding day timeline. Whether or not a couple has a first look before their ceremony can often be impacted by whether or not the sun is setting early as it does in the winter or late during the summer months. So we'll talk through a wedding day timeline and I will help guide them with that. And then the other thing that we'll do is we'll go over their family dynamics and we'll put together a shot list of the family formals. That way we don't miss any important people when we're doing those formal family portraits. And then the rest of the day just kind of happens very organically. I'll capture the getting ready process, the ceremony itself, and then the couple's photos I approach much like I do their engagement sessions. I have the couple interact with each other and engage with each other and just capture those really genuine, authentic moments between the two of them. To me, I think photography is really important because unfortunately the people that we love aren't always gonna be with us. So capturing those sentimental moments, those once in a lifetime moments, are something that we have that we can hold on to when you know the people that we love are no longer with us. And it's just plain fun, you know, capturing great images that evoke, you know, laughter and smiles and genuine emotion and take you back into that really special, meaningful moment. It's just, it's a really um, meaningful kind of fun art and I love to create those memories for my clients. I think one of the biggest common myths about photography is that your camera takes great pictures. And I feel like that's telling your hairdresser that her scissors give you a great haircut. We spend a lot of time educating ourselves on things like flattering posing, flattering light, how to get people that aren't comfortable in front of the camera to be comfortable in front of the camera. So it's not just a camera that makes great photos. When couples inquire with me to book their wedding, I like to either meet with them in person or get on a call with them or do a Zoom call with them just to get to know them and to make sure that I'm a good fit for them and that they're a good fit for me. And if we're a good fit for each other, then we'll talk about their wedding day and we'll go over a brief outline of their wedding day so that I can make a recommendation of how many hours of photography would meet their needs. Once they do that, we'll talk about pricing and if they'd like to proceed with booking, I take a 50% non-refundable retainer and that secures their wedding date. After that, we'll go ahead and get their engagement session scheduled and we'll start the process. Unlike some companies that offer both photography and videography, I specialize only in photography and my specialty is couples photography. So whether it's couples portraits for engagements, I also offer photography for surprise marriage proposals, and then weddings. I think one of the things that makes me different as a wedding photographer is actually my travel photography experience. I like to incorporate a real sense of place into my photographs. So you've booked a gorgeous wedding venue that 
you love the way it looks and it's very meaningful to you as a couple. And I like to incorporate that into your photographs to show off the gorgeous arches that it has in the, in the architecture or the beautiful dock or the pier that it has over the lake and things like that. There's a couple reasons that I think you should hire me for your wedding photographer. Number one, you like my style of work. And number two, we connect on a personal level. Your wedding photographer is somebody that you spend six, eight, even sometimes 10 hours with on your wedding day. So I think it's really important to be comfortable around that person and have a good relationship with them. It's very important to me, not only from a business standpoint, but from a personal standpoint, to be inclusive. And therefore, I am happy to photograph all couples. If you're interested in seeing more of my work, you can find it on my website, lauribarbelly.com, or you can find me on Instagram, at lauribarbelly. I look forward to telling your love story.